Hi guys! Welcome to my channel, Cooking in a Kitchen. Um, andito na naman po ako today to share something to to share something for you. Ayan. So, nag-prepare ako ng uh, isang video. I call this, ito yung sinasabi nating random thoughts. So, like, uulitin ko ulit from my introduction, from my previous video na I will be presenting different videos um, focusing mainly on cooking, cooking tips, uh, food, everything about food, and then alongside with it, mag-i-insert ako ng mga videos about lifestyle, beauty tips, wellness, makeup, random thoughts, and then yung aking uh, uh, domestic travel and local local travel, and then if I have the chance to go abroad for an international racket, yan, so isi-share ko sa inyo yan, and a lot of things, a lot of things, I would like to share a lot of things to you guys, so today, um, this is just a, uh, parang sabihin na nating relax day ulit, nawiwila ako sa relax day kasi we had, ano eh, almost one week, actually one week vacation because of the ASEAN Summit, so by Monday ito, bakbaka na naman sa kusina, bakbaka na naman sa sa school for another week of um, work, 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 work yan, para to contribute to the society, magbayad ka ng tax mo diba, so I'm glad na uh, ayun I, I, at least I, I still have my work and I have my business and I do a lot of things etas eto pa ayan, so marami nga din nga nagsasabi sa akin na I do I have a lot of time to do a lot of things sa akin kasi ang galing ko muna itong glasses ko ah sa akin kasi it's a matter of priority and it's a matter of what you really wanted to do with your life okay sa akin kasi every single day I want to be productive as much as possible sabi ko nga hindi ako pwede yung taong matetenga for that one week naging productive ako because I was able to do a lot of things na isi-share ko sa inyo or ewan ko kung na-ish na hindi um eto nagrarambol na naman ako ang bilis na naman ng utak ko meron ako mga ginawa uh, specifically yung aking maong denim project so um i-share ko yon or i think mauunang mauuna ko ma-share yung video na yon from this video so ayan makikita niyo kung ano yung ginawa ko for the last one week na bakasyon so ngayon medyo relax lang din So, gusto ko lang i-share sa inyo um, muna, siguro while eto, nagre-relax tayo nag mag-make up ako kasi medyo lalabas lang ako ng konti kikembot lang ng konti para sa ekonomiya ng bayan <laughs> alam niyo naman, ako ang uh, inyong abang lingkod na rakitera para sa ekonomiya dahil pag hindi ka kumilos Walang mangyayari sa buhay mo. Kaya nga, sabi ko nga, um, ako yung tipo ng taong pwedeng matenga. Dahil hindi ako pwedeng yung nakatunga nga lang the whole day. It's either I spend most of my time in the kitchen or I spend most of my time in my mini office, in my home office, doing a lot of things. Or doing some crafts. Sabi ko nga sa inyo, mahilig ako ng mga magbuti-buting ting. So, ayan. Um, siguro, habang ginagawa ko rin to, I'll share to you something about me so you'll get to know me better. Okay? So, sino ba si Cooking Ines Kitchen? Cooking Ines Kitchen is Vanilla Vivas Besana. Um, my student call, call me Chef Lea. And then, my friends and my family call me Lea. And then, sa industriya, of course, they call me Chef Lea. So, yan. I've been into... Uh, cooking is Kitchen is a catering services, actually. CIK Catering Services. Um, dalawa yan, actually. It's kusinanay by Chef Lea yung isa. I'm, I have three Facebook page accounts. That's my business accounts. Yung Celebrate Life, the event planner. Because I also into event planning so yun yung business ko yun yung, yun yung business name ng aking 
event planning business. And then yung CIK Catering Services, yun nga yung Cooking in a Kitchen at saka yung Kusinanay by Chef Lea. But mostly, ang pinopost ko sa Cooking in a Kitchen ay yung mga demo, mga cooking demos ko, mga events, food events. And then sa food related naman, doon naman nakapost yung, doon naman sa Kusinanay by Chef Lea. Okay. So, bakit daw cooking in a kitchen? You know guys, I was able to explain why sa isang uh, television show ni Ma'am Winnie Cordero and Ariel Oreta yung DZMM Teleradio yung Todo Todo something something because I guess that they are uh, together with Muff Bex representative during the Manila Food and Beverage Expo So, tinanong nila ako doon, bakit cooking in a kitchen? Guys, with all honesty, no? Idol ko kasi si I Idol as Alas. Guys, di ko alam ko itong ginagawa ko. Trinay ko lang mag-brush. Pero parang hindi ako natutuwa sa mga nangyayari. Sa, nang, sa mga nagaganap. Parang ako yun. Anyway, so yun nga. They asked me why cooking in a kitchen. So, I told them, idol ko si, si I Idol as Alas. So, since siya si cooking, ay, siya si tanging ina, ako naman si cooking ina, para may version. Since I'm a chef, I'm a cook. I cook a lot. And then, I'm a mom also. So, I call myself cooking in a kitchen. And then, it became a business. And then, I became a demo chef on TV. I do demo, cooking demo sa mga malls trade shows and everywhere so I'm a demo chef by profession I'm a caterer event planner and then chef instructor Ayan. so I'll, I will still check if I can disclose the name of the school I am connected to kasi baka magkaroon tayo ng issue anyway sana wag naman ano okay so yon. That's the reason behind cooking in a kitchen. Okay? So, clear na tayo doon. So, how old is cooking in a kitchen? Guys, I'm calibre 45 and I'm proud of being 45. <laughs> Magagawa ba ako? May choice ba ako? At least, di ba, dumating ako sa edad na 45. Yung iba, like, alam niyo naman sa panahon ngayon. Isabel Granada is only 41 and she passed away so tayo we have to be thankful for every we have to be thankful every day for our lives kasi hindi natin alam kung kailan tayo kukunin ng, ng Diyos kung kailan tayo tatawagin diba so ayan ano pa ba ang tanong para kay cooking in a kitchen so Aside from, ayun na, nasabi ko na, aside from catering services, I also teach. I'm a chef instructor, trainer at TESDA, assessor. So, ayan. Tapos, I do consultancy. Food and beverage consultancy sa mga restaurants. And then, I also conduct training, uh, customer service training at uh, personality development. And then, I graduated from the Lyceum of the Philippines. Huwag nyo nang itanong kung kailan. Ay, pero sinabi ko naman na age ko, di ba? Hindi naman ako very secretive pagdating sa ganyan. I graduated 1999. Kasi nag-asawa ako kagad. At nagkaroon ng dalawang anak. Pero pinilit ko pa rin tapusin ang aking pag-aaral. At ang aking tinapos na kurso ay Batsilier ng Ugnayang Panlabas. In English, Bachelor of Science in Foreign Service. I believe that yon yun nga. Idang course ko, Foreign Service. Guys, may lipstick lang ako. Tapusin ko lang to ha. Wait. Hello guys. So ayan, tapos na akong mag lipstick. Ito kasi yung medyo ma-effort na lagi ano eh, na lipstick eh. So ayan yung lipstick na para kang kumain ng buhat. So sabi ko nga, na-enjoy ko yung color niya. 
So, today, ang i-share ko lang sa inyo ay what's in a bag. So, today, sabi ko nga, hindi naman ako pupunta kung saan man. I mean, yung pupuntahan ko is, hindi siya ganun, hindi siya meeting. So, I don't need to wear uh, anything. I mean, I, of course, I have to wear something. I mean, I don't need to make forma forma or corporate attire. So, ito na, ito na yon. So, ano lang siya, casual talk with uh, my cousin. So, coffee, ganyan. So, hindi siya ganun ka-formal. So, uh, para lang, uh, just to give you an idea kung ano yung aking, uh, let's make this video 20 minutes, okay? Pinaalala ano na sarili. So, anyway, so what's in my bag? So today, yun nga, aalis lang ako for, for a casual talk with my cousin. So ang dala ko lang na bag is itong bag ko na carry-on bag na, ha, alam nyo yun, um, madali lang siyang bitbitin and ganyan. So, what's inside my bag? Nasanay na akong magdala ng payong. So I have my umbrella. So ayan. Sa totoo lang, nagganin ko na yung glasses ko guys ha. Sa totoo lang talaga, um, hindi ako pala dala ng payong. But since nag-uulan at ang hirap talaga, ang hirap pagka, teka lang, lagay okay, ulit, sorry ha, magulo masyado, aligaga. So yun, first item in my bag is ang aking umbrella. Ang dami kong sinasabi talaga, ba? At hindi ko makakalimutan yung holder ng aking glasses na ito. Itong suot ko ngayon, which is blue. So yung eto yung ha, ano niya uh, lalagyan ng aking glasses tapos yung aking red na glasses dito siya nakalagay okay so dadalhin ko din siya kasi red ako may red red yung dala kong bag wala bakit gusto ko dalawang glasses ang dala ko minsan kasi na misplace ko anyway so eto yung aking makeup kit mamaya ako papakita sa inyo kung ano laman yan tapos i have my organizer i have my planner Yan. So, yan. No? Meron ako nakalagay to do. So, ibig sabihin, importante yan kasi nilagyan ko. Tapos, may document akong dapat basahin. Ibig sabihin. So, I also have my mini organizer or my mini notebook. So, lahat ng mga something-something is nandito. Yung tipong, halimbawa, may nadaanan ako na store na, kunyari, bakery supply siya. Sulat ako pa agad. Dito. Dito yan. Ito yan yung mabilis siyang hugutin. Tapos, I have my coin purse. So, ayan. Coin purse siya na cute, diba? So, ayan. Tapos, of course, yung aking handkerchief. Tapos, meron akong ito, pencil case, guys. Ang hilig ko sa anik-anik. So, ang laman nito, ayan, meron ako ditong plating and presentation kit tools. Ayan. Precision tong. So, ito yung pag nagpe-plating ako. Ayan. Yung pang ganyan ko. So, ayan. Kasama yan sa pang araw-araw kong buhay. So, tas marami akong ball pen. Marami akong ball pen na orange. <laughs> At iba-ibang kulay. Lahat yan. USB, lahat. Meron akong gunting na maliit. Tapos meron akong... Ito, this is from St. Petersburg. Yan ang ganda. Okay. Yan. Ball pen yan. Tapos may magnet sa ano. So, dala ko siya everyday. Meron akong, ano, ah, uh, ano ay ito? Notepad. Ano? Stick on. Ay, ano? Okay, basta rin. Yun, pandikit. Tapos, meron akong maliit na ganito. So, yan. Yan ang laman ng aking um, pencil case. Parang bata lang. Ayan. Tapos, I have my wallet. Ito. Guys, ito. Kapartner ng ball pen. This is from St. Petersburg as well. In Russia. Bigay din lang sa akin yan ni Miss Tatiana Khan when I went there. So, ang laman ng wallet ko ay ayan. Mga resibo. Tapos, pinupul siyang ganyan. Ayan yung mga cards ko and everything. Ayan. Tingnan ko anong magkano laman ng wallet ko. Baka mahabag kayo. <laughs> so, ayan. Tapos, I have my ID. I have my home keys. Tapos, ito. Ito yung aking rosary. 
Ayan. Tapos, extra watch. Ayan. Tapos, I have with me yung aking Orthodox Patron Saint. Saint Gleb and Saint Borg. Tama ba? Saint Borg. Borg and Gleb. Si sila yung aking patron saint in July 24. I bought this in, ano, saan nga ito? Doon sa isang uh, cathedral sa St. Petersburg. St. Peter. St. Peter, the St. Peter Cathedral something. So, doon, meron silang mga pinibentang mga ganito. So, I bought this one for myself. Tapos, palagi ko siyang bit-bit. So, for the protection. Tapos, I also have, I bought neck, ano din eh, um, pendant sa St. Petersburg din. Ayan. I just don't, I'm not sure if this is St. Gleb or St. Boris pala, not Borg. St. Boris and St. Gleb yung aking Orthodox Church. Ay, Orthodox patron saint. So, hindi ko lang alam din kung sino dito kasi Russian Sulat, eh. So, yan. I bought it there when I went to St. Petersburg, Russia. So, tapos I have the office keys. Tapos I have my IDs. Ano, important IDs. Government IDs. Issued IDs. So, everything is here. So, yan. So, yan yung laman ng aking bag on a daily basis. Yung mga wala namang, wala naman akong pupuntahan. Very, very important na yung, yun lang magchichill or magka-coffee, so ganun lang but um, normally kasi I, I bring two, two bags parang ano lang yun no? kasi hindi talaga kasi sa isang bag or kung, ewan ko but may mga ganong klaseng babae no? yung parang hindi kasi sa isang bag so dalawang bag yung dadalhin kasi mabibigatan yung isa eh pag binitbit mo naman din sabay ang bigat pa din So, di ba? Ewan ko lang. Basta, um, kasi meron kang ibang bag na pinangangalagaan mo ng gusto. So, lahat ng importante yung bagay mo doon mo nakalagay. Tapos, doon sa another bag naman, yung medyo yung mabilisang hugot lang. Like, payong, makeup kit, or something. So, ganun. Ganun ako. Tapos, pag sa school naman ito, ito yung dala kong bag. Medyo formal-formalan siya. So, Siyempre, hindi ko naman dadaling ngayon. I have my extra wallet or extra makeup kit. So, pagka konting may makeup kit lang yung dala ko. Yan. So, I also have my portable speaker. Para, wala. Minsan kasi, ano eh. Basta, <laughs> gusto ko mag-speaker eh, di ba? And then, this is my techie, techie pouch. So, yung aking power bank, cables and everything. Um, headset. USB, extra USB, and everything. Nandiyan. Nandito pala. Tapos, what else? So, ito naman. This is uh, paper towel. So, kailangan yun. Some must for me. Tapos, ito nga yung aking speaker. Extra, extra pouch. Kung ano yung maisip kong mailagay dyan. Then, I also have, ito naman, kapag I, pag, uh, when I travel, kunyari, long, 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 long trip. Kunyari, bus or mga, di ma, minsan going bag yung ilang hours yan. So, I bring my Kindle. Medyo old school ako pagdating sa ano eh. I mean, um, ewan ko, I, I want everything separately. Hindi ako yung tipo na tao na parang mobile, gagawin, lalagay mo na dun yung yung ebook mo, tapos gawin mo siyang camera. Ewan ko, I still, ito, I, I super love my Kindle. Okay? Meron akong hard cap, mga hard bound books dyan, but I still have my Kindle. Kasi ito, maraming ano eh, marami siyang uh, books na ina-upload ko dito. So, ayan. Meron akong almost um, basta marami, marami akong Marami akong books na nandito. So, when I travel, I bring this along with me. Ayan. So, this is my Kindle. Kindle 2 ata. Ito kung the Kindle 1. So, black and white pa siya. Anyways, hindi siya yung Kindle Fire. I also have my iPad. Actually, this is my son's iPad. So, 
Ayan. So, ako na yung gumagamit ngayon. So, ayan. Kulay orange siya. My favorite color. So, dala-dala ko lang siya pagka, for example, I have something to show to my students na mga photos. So, ganyan. Files and everything kasi medyo mabigat. But ka, naka-laptop ka. But pag dala-dala mo sa school yung laptop. Okay, since we have also computer sa, sa laboratory. So, dun lang. Yan ang ginagamit ko. So, eto yung aking makeup kit. So, what's inside my makeup kit? Of course, ang aking Queen Leona perfume. Personalized perfume na. Ito yung Amoy D&G Blue. This is, this is what I bring along with me every time. I have my alcohol, hindi pwedeng mawala. I have my pressed powder. I have my comb. I have my Myra E. Lotion. I have my pocket mirror. It was given to me. Pa pero parang ba, ano ko na siya, iwanan ko na siya. Nakakabigat siya sa makeup kit ko. Kasi I have this, ano na yun, oh, mirror dito sa aking pressed powder. Extra pantali sa hair. Yung aking uh, MAC lipstick with a shade of pale pink. The shade that I chose for this one is A37. And ang pangalan niya ay, hindi ko mabasa. Ang hirap. Ah, uh, brave. Basta brave lang yung nakita ko. Anyways, I have my, ito yung sinisinghot ko sa bus. Hindi ako pwedeng mawala nito dahil mahiluhin ako sa bus, guys. Yun ang one secret, one thing about me, mahiluhin ako sa bus. Mayroon akong spray, mouth uh, spray ang aking lip balm na hindi pwedeng mawala. I have my concealer stick para um, retouch. I also have this BL cream. Ito yung pang katikate or something pag nakagat ka ng lamok or ito. Ito nga kapula siya. So, nilalagay ko lang siyang ganyan. Parang ano ito, skin antibiotic. Tapos, I have my nail cutter. Tapos, meron ako dito mga clips. Ayan, of different colors. Ayan. Okay. So, ayan, ang laman ng ako. Hala, 22 minutes na, guys. So, I think I have covered everything na uh, for this video. I've shown you uh, what's inside my bag and a little bit about myself. And then, I will be I will be posting another uh, separate video about um, facts of, about me like 50 facts about me so guys sobra <laughs> sobra I'm so ganyan that's this is the this is the fun part of doing YouTube video kasi this is spontaneous this is um, you can say everything that you want that that everything that you want to share to your um, to your viewers so guys thank you very much for watching this video and if you like this video just press the like button and then uh, share and please subscribe to my channel cooking in a kitchen at ang palagi ko pong pinapaalala sa inyo guys ang batang masipag paglaki pagod ito po ang inyong cooking in a kitchen and have a nice day guys see you again on my next video bye